The First Reformed Church of Saddlebrook presents to you Chris First Chat Weekly inspirational messages that preach God's word And now, here's the host of Chris First Chat, the Reverend Christopher B. Wolf. Hi, Pastor Christopher, Chris First Chat And this week, we've already done the candles of hope and peace this week we did the candle of joy and I want to talk to you a bit about joy I think in this world it's pretty joyless you would agree with that and then we would say any joy or happiness we do find is pretty temporary sometimes through destructive things like substances and alcohol and things like that or maybe some nice things a birthday party things like that but Joy is hard to find. And so Isaiah chapter 64 tells us where we can find real joy, true joy. Uh, And that comes from uh, this idea that Jesus was born and it was good news to the oppressed. It was good news in a time where they could barely hear any good news. Joy is surprise. Joy is that thing when you say, yeah, right, that could happen. And then it happens. And I encourage you to Search your story. Look back. There have been plenty of times where you thought, that can't happen. And then it did. Really good stuff. Reconciliation, forgiveness, healing, getting over things. It's happened. Restoration. And then the other part of joy is being freed from stuff, being liberated. A whole bunch of verses in Isaiah 64 talk about the captives are going to be freed. Uh, The people who are oppressed are going to be liberated. That's joy. When we throw off something that's holding us down, could be an addiction. Could be grief. Grief is is mentioned often in Isaiah 64 because, 61, because it's, uh, it's so oppressive. So if you're looking for joy, look for those places where you're stuck and how God can free you. That's where we're going to find joy. Happiness. That's going to last a few minutes. The joy of Jesus coming into this world, turning the world upside down, that's going to last forever. That's with us now, even those thousands of years ago. I encourage you to find real joy this season. God bless you.